The Imagine pad. a USS Biden completely com- <laughs> keeps getting lost. Keep, <laughs> keep getting keep getting lost. The sonars never work. It just just keeps getting like this is our main landing ship. It tips over. Whatever you say, it tips the radio- over in water. <laughs> the radar s- scrambles. The telecommunications. Whatever you say, the radio comes out as like. <laughs> 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 See how awkward that was? Uh, you didn't think about that. That was funny as fuck. Okay, yeah, I mean, that, 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 that worked. worked. That worked. That the worked, easiest absolutely. way. I mean, we're going to talk about something uh, maybe not so funny. Not so, funny bit, so might as well start off yeah. with a laugh. Yeah. Uh, the This whole submarine thing, I have... Uh, I, I didn't follow it. You didn't? No, I didn't Lucky. It. Yeah. it didn't go so well for the people on board. <laughs> so what exactly happened there? Uh, some billionaires. I did. I don't know all the details either, okay, right? Okay. I, I did hear a lot of people yeah. talking about it, so I just kind of pieced it together. So here's how I would put it: a bunch of billionaires decided to make a very extravagant expedition to the bottom of the sea, okay. while sparing as much money as possible <laughs> at the worst places possible. Okay. So you know, use the Logitech controller. They just. Uh, I also, Paul told me that uh, the little thing that you can look out on yeah. is uh, only made for one third of the distance, like the depth yeah. that they were using it for. But engineers always calculate for three times and then, or the way they then do it is like, like sure. Yeah, yeah, it takes this, so let's use 33% of that and then it's definitely sure. Mm-hmm. So they just went, that's fine then, because it's kind of three times the depth. It mm-hmm. says three times, so we'll just do that. and. Also, this guy runs logic, so we just use the controller to manage what could possibly go wrong. So everything. What, what, <laughs> yeah, what did they want to do? Look yeah. at the Titanic. Okay. They then. didn't want to rent a DVD. Uh, they okay. wanted to go down. <laughs> Because, you know, it's not like people didn't do this before. You could have rented a DVD. Imagine if they went down there, then set up a Beamer and then watched Watch the Titanic, Titanic on, on the, the Titanic. Titanic. <laughs> They were on the boat, yeah. beaming it on the inside wall. So they watched it on the Titanic, on, on the, the Titanic. Titanic. They watched Titanic on the, the Titanic, Titanic, on the, the Titanic. Titanic. These fucking people have no creativity. No imagination. <laughs> <laughs> Look, what, it took us, what, two minutes? Yeah. How long did it to come up with a better idea? Yeah, but we, we would and have also, been probably smart they, enough not to take, like, they uh, had three a little, times the depth, let's go. Okay. They had a little window like this. Yeah. We are already thinking a beamer. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, it's so much better. Yeah. Oh my oh, god. Uh, so. Oh, and by the way, there's yeah. another thing I read is that you know they were looking with sonars and shit to yeah. see if they can hear them. Yeah. But it imploded due to the depth, like yeah. it couldn't handle so to the pressure. The, to yeah. the pressure, so they died like this quick, and that makes a little sonic. Yeah. That makes a sound underwater, and they were looking for four days, hoping they can find them. And after they said, yeah, the oxygen ran out at this point, so yeah. there's no way we're going to get them back alive. And I think some military said, oh, by the way, I don't know if I mentioned this, but we heard on our sonars a little like four days ago. Do you guys might know anything about that? <laughs> oh, so they heard, they, they, the military heard them. Some before, military okay. around there was like, oh, yeah, that totally showed up on our thing, but we just didn't bother telling you guys. Yeah. You, you, you all looked so happy looking. So, so they already knew. Yeah. The moment it disappeared, it was like, yeah, it just went. Yeah. God. So they, they like, inst- it was like not that they were stuck down there. They just went too deep. They just and, went, yeah. They yeah. Just and they went, went like, be- because if a submarine implodes, it usually means that something structural failed, right? So They had no structure. They had a titanium <laughs> cylinder that had to be weld shut. Oh, so they didn't even have a door. <laughs> so, it just, so it just went... In like, I don't know, a twen- a tw- two millionth of a size, really fast. Like it just went, it, they didn't feel shit. Oh. I heard a doctor explain that it, I don't know if it's millionth now, maybe yeah. I'm saying something stupid, but it- Very quickly. It yeah. was it was 0.02 yeah. seconds and for it, for it in something, milli, qu- mm-hmm. whatever mm-hmm. seconds, and for pain to reach your brain, it's da, 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 four. Yeah. So it was quicker. It, it was qui- like a lot quicker. Yeah. Oh, it man. just, yeah. But and that was while they were still looking the speculations as well, that if they, if the little hole, yeah. the 
thing breaks, yeah. they get sucked out. Oh, yeah, because the... the pressure inside is way more. Oh, so it's. Oh, what a horrible way to die. <laughs> it's grim. Anywhere you go. What a horrible way to die. See, billionaires, when you're so stimulated, you need stuff like this to masturbate. Yeah, but like, <laughs> we do have better submarines. Like, why do you have to weld yourself shut into a titanium? Because they were saving money. Like, literally? Or I, are you, are I, th I don't know. But apparently, everything was fucking bootleg. Every everything was shit. You know, if you if you look at it, everything inside looked bad and stuff. But there's like twenty years ago, there's other little submarines going just as deep. And yeah, you know, but with like the inside didn't, camera. Didn't Cameron, what's his name, James Cameron? Yeah, didn't yeah. he go down there like with a submarine and yeah, actually he, filmed the whole he, thing? Well, he cost more money, I guess. Because no, but like he had like back then, like Titanic is how old now? Like twenty something. No, 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 no. The the movie. Oh, yeah. It's 99, something like that. Yeah, it's yeah. like pretty old, right? So 99. back then he could go down there and film everything in a small submarine. Maybe it was like a robot. Uh, I think... I mean, like yeah, there was no I'm human sure. on board. It yeah, was yeah. A, a drone. A drone or something. Maybe, yeah. I don't know. I'm not think. sure. Yeah. Yeah, maybe I, I love can... doing this with zero research, by the way. Yeah, That's me too. Me too. Me too. We, 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 correct we... us in the comments. Yeah, correct us, please. Yeah. <laughs> I dare you. I double dare you to correct me I, in the comments. I, I I only found out about this from like memes on Instagram. <laughs> and uh, the only thing I watch, but I'm like, sometimes I see like something is happening and it's hyping up and everybody's talking about it and I just actively ignore it and because it's usually... Yeah. It, so I, I saw like this meme where somebody was like, f like four, there were four people, right? Uh, so four I billionaires so. in a, in a, in a submarine and then they had like this list of like how many like you know vessels from different armies and private companies were there to try to save them and then like a week or something before that like a refugee ship sank in the mediterranean and like there was like uh, two like uh, volunteer vessels to like try to save and, them. and blow up boats like they're bogus yeah 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 and well you know the difference what the refugee boat had zero billionaires yeah yeah, that's, that's the problem. That's, they should have thought of that before trying to cross the Mediterranean. Just yeah. let's put one motherfucker on yeah. board. I'm just so dumb yeah, but <laughs> it's like yeah, but 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 the the uh, the refugee boat. It was. I think the caption said like, "If next time, if you are on a boat, remember to have a billionaire with you." Yeah. Well, yeah. it helps. It helps apparently. <laughs> yeah. And everybody comes to save you. Exactly. Ah, okay. Or just lie that you have one. Like yeah, we're then, sinking, we're sinking. Like it's who? Who are you? It's like, well, it's three of my friends and Bill Gates. <laughs> What's he doing with you? It's we were doing an expedition, a uh, secret expedition. Nobody yeah, knows. Nobody that he's knows, here. but trust me, he's here. Can you put him on the phone? No. <laughs> Why not? Listen, I'm the one asking. <laughs> I'm making the request here. Do you have a billionaire in your room? No. Well, I, I have do. one in my. <laughs> So why don't you just send the helicopter and we'll hash out the details once you're here, okay? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> just send the helicopter first though, yeah. Didn't somebody do that? That was also like an online joke where uh, he called, somebody called the police, I think in the US called the police, I think there's an intruder in my house. Yeah. Oh my God, he's like, yeah, well, we can't really send anybody right now because, you know, we're really spread yeah. thin and maybe I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck is that? And I called them back two minutes later. All good. I shot him in the chest six times. Yeah. I'm burying the body or I'm thinking about burning yeah. it on my front yard. I don't yeah. know what. <laughs> Eleven <laughs> cars. <laughs> <laughs> Who the fuck is that? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> so you do have <laughs> enough people. <laughs> it's so easy. You just play him like that. Or the other one where it's like, it's so uh, hard to get like a security company to watch my house. Yeah. So I just put up an ISIS flag. <laughs> Now I have CIA, <laughs> FBI, <laughs> Homeland Security, <laughs> security <laughs> monitoring everything. Yeah. Like, this is awesome. Yeah. Um, but like, oh, man, the, I, I'm still thinking about like a metal tube imploding. And you, what it sounded like, like uh, two seconds before. Do you think it went? 
I don't know, man. Like it started because then it happened like, did, really did, fast. Did they know? Like, did they, were they like, oh, we fucked up? Like, did they like realize? I'm sure oh. they knew because they lost like connection to everybody, yeah. and they were just thinking. I think that was also a did problem. They, I'm not sure. Correct me if I'm wrong. Yeah. If you dare. Were they uh, running like Windows 98 or something, and they got like a? Well, I, it's that. either that, but I think they lost control of the vessel itself, so uh -huh. it just started sinking. So it like might, uncontrollably just going just down going. To, to the point where it like yeah so it's even like they knew that you know that we only were meant to go like three and a half k yeah. kilometers but at this rate we're gonna hit six kilometers real fucking fast and i think if it was not supposed to so you know at that one point i'm sure they knew that it was like all right yeah. listen guys let's say our prayers maybe I don't know, did they have like a bottle of something to have a final toast in case shit hits the that fan? That must have been a quick toast though. Cause I, I <laughs> imagine if they pour it out, it's like, Would you, well, like, imagine, she, and then it implodes. Wait a second, imagine you were in that situation. Would you like to know or would you like to, for it to just happen? That's a really good question. I'd probably like to know. Yeah, I'm not sure. Yeah, I, I don't, I think I'd want to know. Because it's so much more weird if you're just sitting there excited. Oh, you don't want to die like, uh, like a Sudden. dumb person? <laughs> no, just, you know, just having, talking about some minuscule shit. I, 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 would, I think I would prefer a moment where if it's us, we're like, instead of, oh, by the way, yesterday I met this, uh, I know, this, 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 talking about yeah. shit. Instead it's like, well, Homer, looks like just you and me. Let's yeah. have a final yeah. toast, clink. Oh, so you would like to have like a moment at least a to, gracious yeah. cheers, a toast. Yeah. It was a good ride. Mm. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure, I, but it I makes think... sense to me. Yeah, I, I, it makes sense to me that that uh, I would like to have it to like just compose myself a final time, like say like make my peace with the, the, the way things are. But on the other side, if it's like happening very quickly, yeah, maybe I would just like to like oh look at that. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. That's what I don't know. I think I would prefer to know. Yeah. Because then apparently if something went bad and they heard the thing four days earlier. Yeah. I would they rather... They were like, hey guys, something yeah. went wrong. Fuck, what are we going to do? And 30 minutes yeah. later, you're gone. Yeah. yeah. So if they had... Like, I don't know. Because they all had to... I signed a waiver like, you might die. Yeah, da, da, da. Yeah, yeah. So, you know, if that was me, I would have a, a bottle of good whiskey and... A rum yeah, or yeah, a joint, yeah. a cigar, you yeah. know, like. Yeah, but I think a joint or a cigar or something like that will kill you quicker down there because <laughs> you have no air. Yeah, but if I know, like, all right, we're gonna implode oh, yeah. in one minute yeah, and but, 30 but, seconds. But, quick, 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 quick. <laughs> cheers. <laughs> <laughs> all right, now I can implode. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Mm -hmm. I think it would, in a nah, way, I, more I think I, I think I would rather be the guy who dies while he's like doing this with the DVD of Titanic. Yeah. <laughs> 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 like, <laughs> I would rather I would rather have that. I don't like, know. I, I would like not to not to no. You know, I the feel like I would. The, fight, the the funny thing because this is like something I heard and then I was like, oh, I remember this because it, the the vessel was called the Titan, and it was made out of titanium. They were going to look at the Titanic, and before the Titanic sank, like I don't know, like twelve years before the Titanic, there was a book about a ship that hits an iceberg and sinks, and it's called the, the sh in the book the ship was called the Titan. So these billionaires decided to take the name of a ship that sank of the fink fictional <laughs> s ship that sank in a book that coincidentally had like similar name and a similar the titanic and consequent yeah 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 it's like one of those things in history you know where like uh, the fiction basically happened before the reality yeah so they they the same thing happened to them like and then they're, they're like in the, i i if i was like in any kind of like capacity to name any vessel ever again like in the history of humanity, it had it would have nothing to do with Titan. It would have nothing to do with anybody who died through something stupid. Like no, that. but like, like Titan, I'm gonna, Titan. At I'm, least I'm gonna yeah. call it the Achilles. That still sounds like, <laughs> like so. It has one vulnerable point, but that's like really vulnerable. <laughs> like exactly. this, this is the Achilles. <laughs> We're gonna take it to Mars. Yeah. This 
ship is fucking indestructible except for this one little thing here that if you like flick it's it like the dead star if, yeah, if you <laughs> flick it it just, <laughs> just explodes it has just a sign that says like do not touch exactly do not under no <laughs> circumstances <laughs> press this button <laughs> It's integral. It's the weakest point. You can you can destroy it so easily. And there's one OCD guy like standing in front of yeah. it the whole time, like Just having sweating. a break the <laughs> shaking, yeah. sweating. I can't. I can't. Yeah. Yeah. Nothing shitty, right? Like you, we have to have. But what was like indestructible? Like that actually remained indestructible yeah. too. We're gonna call this ship God. <laughs> God unspecified. <laughs> Any and all God. USS God. <laughs> USS God. God damn it though. See? Because you can't find the name. Yeah. Mythorical, historical, anything. Eventually. It something bad happened to them. Eh? Or time caught up. You no, know? But, like time catching up is good, right? Like it, so in Afghanistan <laughs> we have this thing if somebody's wearing like new clothes, we we wish them to wear them out. Ah, you know? yeah, I see. So yeah. it's it means like I hope these clothes don't survive you, you know? Yeah. So time is good, right? Like you survive, like wear and tear, and like some like technology caught up to you. But is is uh, like what what would be like? I don't know. Like the um, Americans name like you know ships after presidents and stuff like that so i'm not sure <laughs> no they can't do that for no me. like this I, is the uss I, trump I, it, it, there will be a uss trump like uh i think um as long as there's no uss biden i'm fine but, but there it. is there is a like a imagine pattern. a uss biden completely come <laughs> keeps getting we'll lost keep getting <laughs> keep getting lost the sonars never work <laughs> It just, just keep getting like, this is our main landing ship. It tips over. Whatever you say, it tips in the radio. over in water. <laughs> the radar scrambles. The telecommunications. Whatever you say, in the radio comes out as like. <laughs> <laughs> the buy ship is on crack. Yeah, it just <laughs> arrives at the wrong location. Oh God! Bombs the wrong location. Well, that will be very American again. Then I mean, the USS Biden. <laughs> <laughs> Well, that will be any American ship. Any American president bombed at least one wrong location. Think about it. George Washington didn't. He pretty sh I'm definitely I mean, that he, he like shot one cannon into <laughs> something wrong. Okay, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> he fucked up one like bird's nest. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he was just like, what the fuck, man? <laughs> like, I just finished it. Just like pigeons like... <laughs> George, like, like the meme of the Middle Eastern dude. Like, uh, yeah, exactly. The, the football, Pakistani dude with the. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, god damn. Fire, oh, fire, this, this, the this whole from... submarine thing is like very depressing. It, it sucks. It's so sad that it goes full circle somehow. Yeah. Because you know it's tragic for the families, but at the same time, you guys were fine. You didn't have to, have to do it. You kind of did this to yourself. So it was also not like, you know, space exploration or something like heroic like that, that they were doing it for humanity. Wait, so wait, watch this. I'm going to get water off camera. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're... It's being refilled. Can you hear it? It's still in my hand. The cup never left my hand. That's why I had to hold it out. Well, look, I'm look happy. at this. I'm very happy I didn't follow, uh, follow this news uh, cycle for this submarine yeah, it was basically submarine is lost yeah. here's a bunch of details about why it's not really surprising that it's lost but it's also kind of sad yeah we're all looking then a day later okay, all right listen we didn't find them but if the oxygen ran out at this point so this yeah. is and not, then like this, there's no way it's ending this well. admiral comes and hey by the way <laughs> Four days ago, we had we heard this weird sound. We had no idea what it was, yeah. but we, you guys were having yeah. so much fun looking, so we just didn't want to ruin oh, it. Oh God! Yeah, I guess like, at least it happened. I fast. also like the morbid, <coughs> the morbid part of my brain goes into like maybe they just waited for it, so you know all those search crews like make money, you know, because they were like probably getting paid well to do it. Uh, yeah, they, they met the navy and the search crew met at the port at the pier. And the search crew was like, oh man, you know, I know it's terrible, but we really need something to do because nobody's been getting <laughs> lost. We need to feed our family. And the, uh, the Marines were like, four days. <laughs> you have four days. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> go fight them. Ah, uh, well, so at least at least I think imploding is better than suffocating slowly. A hundred percent. But then again, keep in mind if you're down there with me, mm. you're suffocating in smoke. Because the, <laughs> the, the moment we find out, you and I, we're not going back up ever again. Yeah. There's not even anything you can leave yeah. for your loved ones or the search group yeah. to find. Because yeah. yeah. everything's fucked. Yeah. If the little window gets yeah. fucked, we all get sucked out through that shit. Yeah. So nothing to find. Yeah. If we get crushed, <laughs> there's nothing to find. Yeah. There's no way we're going to be smelling each other's farts until the air runs out. Yeah. We're going to be selling, smelling... This smoke, baby, <laughs> with this really fancy <laughs> bottle of whiskey. I'm a billionaire, remember? We both are, because yeah, we went yeah, down yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. So here's a 1928 bottle of something really fancy. Yeah. With a huh and a cigar that's 50 years old. Yeah. And this is the best weed money can buy. Yeah. Go for it. We have 15 minutes before suffocation. Let's go. Yeah. yeah. But again, like, would you not rather try to save yourself till the very last moment? How? No, like you open the hatch and swim up. No, but like <laughs> <laughs> when it sucks you out, <laughs> yeah. and you, there is no hatch because you're welded in. You make yourself really narrow, so when the thing breaks, <laughs> you just shoot through it. You're just <laughs> standing in <laughs> one. You got some scratches on your shoulders. Ah, yeah. like, oh, god! <sighs> and once you're out there and somehow survive the pressure change and hold your breath, you now have a light four and a half kilometer swim <laughs> upstairs. <laughs> I mean, who can't do that? What are you, a pussy? Come on. <laughs> Hold oh, your breath shit. and power through it. So, no. Oh, okay. Also, yeah. you know how divers have to stop when they're coming up from distances? They have to go slowly, so, you have yeah. to hold your breath. You have a four and a half kilometer yeah. swim up, which yeah. has never been attempted. And you have to stop every hundred meters for yeah. a few minutes. So, the nitrogen levels in your blood even out. Yeah. yeah I think you're you can, fucked. You're David fucked. Goggins would have made it. I don't he know. He would have found a way. <laughs> Yeah, he would, he would have. have held it from implosion. He would have split the sea. <laughs> That's Moses. Yeah. Oh, I'm uh, oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> David Moses. David Moses. <laughs> David Moses. Uh, I don't want to Mo think about this shit anymore. Moses but. Goggins. Yeah, Moses uh, Goggins. <laughs> yeah. Something like. Yeah, another thing about rich people doing stupid shit. Uh, did you hear about the whole like revolt in Russia? Of course. Like, I also, like, I heard about it and I was like, what the fuck is going on? Like, I literally, we were doing a podcast here. We sat down. We did the podcast, like, for 90 minutes. We, we After we stood up, Manuel is, like, really busy on the phone. I'm like, what's going on? And, like, he's like, yeah, it's work because, like, apparently the, in this 90 minutes, like, a revolt happened in Russia. <laughs> and now everything now is I'm resolved. <laughs> like, what? Yeah. As I'm sure, because, you know, this happened at the same time the Pentagon lost track of 6.2 billion. Yeah. Approximately at the same time, I would bet money that CIA just went like, hey, man, you want to, like, throw over Putin? We'll pay 6.2 billion. So just to explain, okay, what happened was there's this private security... Wagner Group. Wagner Group called... Uh, this is a private mercenary company... That Which basically the guy works. looks like as well, if you've seen him. He just yeah. like, his, his business card doesn't have to say private mercenary company leader. He just yeah. has to say, look at my face. You yeah. can probably guess it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he looks pretty. Like, he looks pretty. Yeah, he's like prison gulag boss yeah. or yeah. private. It's, it was either that or that. <laughs> he used to be Putin's cook. Uh, apparently he used to be put his cook like uh, this is uh, okay like, well this is me this... just scrolling through like memes okay yeah. so but this is the thing I, if that's true and i've seen this thing where mm. what happened was the guy went through and then they made putin just like tell them please stop and then he went all right and then he turned back and took the their positions again yeah because the day before so this private company basically works for the russian um uh, government and is fighting in uh in ukraine yeah and for some reason, a day before this whole thing happened, the Russian army attacked them, the, one of their bases. I didn't know about that. Yeah, okay. yeah. So this, I, I, this I mean, is that's like me scrolling. To piss people off. Yeah, yeah I so, would be angry too. And then they like, uh, by the time we were, before we sat down for the podcast, I, I, I went through the news and it's like, oh, they're like, basically they took over a city in uh, like 400 kilometers so, uh, south of Moscow and are now moving to Moscow. Moscow yeah. And I was like, what? 
the hell is going on? Yeah. Like, it's, it's like, why is there a private security company? And that I found out why there is this private security company. That's very weird. But <clears throat> so the, the, then like, you're a lot better read up on this no, than I No, 90 am. minutes. No, I'm not. Like, you, you just know less. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, so 90 minutes after, like, after we did the podcast, it was like, yeah, this uh, guy, P- Protoshkin or right, whatever. Mr. Yeah. P. Yeah. yeah, Mr. P is going to just go to Belarus now and stay there. And uh, Putin is cool with that. And the whole thing is over. And I was like, How? So this happened. So this is your theory. My theory, and I've also seen this online. At the same time, the Pentagon loses 6.2 bill, sends it to Ukraine. Yeah. Loses, sends to Ukraine, and mm. I don't know which version now is the mm. most actual. But it's a, mm. you know, CIA does stuff like that. So yeah, they just yeah. called Mr. P. Said, yeah. "You want to do a coup? We can offer to pay 6.2 bill." He's like, "Let me call you back, yeah. Vlado." <laughs> <laughs> I got offered 6.2 bill. It's like, okay, listen, why don't you just march towards us a little bit? We split the money, then you retake your position. Sounds good, bro. If that was his cook. Yes, we do this. No problem. (laughs) We take over. Yeah. And uh, oh, I also see as they were, you've seen probably the footage of them like shooting at buildings. No. Uh, During the coup. No, Like it was like, you didn't see any video of it. Like, no, no, I I don't watch like war footage. But yeah, it was basically soldiers on the street taking positions and Mm -hmm. stuff. And as it was going on, some dude with an e-scooter yeah. rolled past them blasting, because I got high. Because I got high. Because I got high. <laughs> 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 like, and they're like all like, <laughs> They're all like on the corner, like yeah. looking like, ah, oh, damn, I'm spitting. Yeah. It's a good topic. Yeah. And like, because I got high. <laughs> like, Fuck, am I doing this because I got high? I don't know. <laughs> So, <laughs> oh, and they retook different positions closer to Kiev. So I'm sure there's some fuckery in the whole news because yeah. now I'm going to go home after this and research all the details yeah. just to see how much of what they said I don't believe. Because mm. I like at this point, any media story comes out is like, what are you not telling me? Yeah, yeah, exactly. You fucked up so much in the last four years. At this point, I don't even believe your questions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I have to look at everything from far left to far right, everything in between. And you're like, all right, you had one, two, three, and not th- and you said these things, but it matches. What's like, missing? So yeah. th- this is this yeah. is the story, yeah, right? Yeah. You know, like... The negative, like, basically. Th- th- yeah. This is the full yeah. story, like, somehow, yeah. and you're still not hearing yeah. stuff. Yeah. Like, I'm still completely sure that, you know, when there's, like, some outrage story, is uh, is a cover up for anything like they just signed some documents it's yeah. like fuck we need a distraction it's like putin can you use the f word when describing the lgbtq community sure yeah. no problem these yeah. they drop the tech oh my god it's just yeah. like putin how could you it's like if you had any idea what i just signed in the yeah. room yeah, yeah. this would be nothing yeah but talk it's about like this they're mother. signing it like bad putin yeah <laughs> bad putin bad <laughs> which is bad. not saying that putin is not bad but God damn no, it. no, but all of yeah, the, but th- you know. this whole thing was a real like, uh, it was like just like weird because it was very entertaining for like three hours. Yeah, it's like, <laughs> I, is, is this the shortest coup ever? Like, no, I'm sure there were shorter ones. Yeah, I'm sure the guy got out of his house and because <laughs> <laughs> how many coup attempts do you think there is that they know of, and they're just waiting for him? Yeah, like, yeah, oh yeah. 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 We're reading your text messages, so you guys are meeting up at four. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Ah, this location, nice. Uh, and it's just like, hey, nice. So you ready to? Drink? <laughs> oh well, that was fast. Uh, um, oh, I, can't I have dinner we, plans. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe we're home for dinner. That's so awesome. Yeah. But uh, th- there was also like um, uh, one one thing because why these private like I was thinking like totalitarian government they have a private army basically wow that's so under crazy the, under the no but why why this is the, why not so i i'm not sure if this applies to wagner group too but i'd have one if i was a <clears throat> putin type character just for the shits and giggles i'd call them some funny name too wagner group <laughs> I mean, a german name I <laughs> and make them use like a bunch of nazi symbol symbolism and only hire jews <laughs> uh, uh, but I'll make it confusing. I have different battalion. I have a battalion called the African Americans, which will be consisted of gingers. <laughs> I have 
the female murderers and it would be like the biggest Russian bearded bear dudes, <laughs> you know. And yeah, but that could mean like they murder females. Yeah, actually, I just had the same thought as I was finishing the thought. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. So, you, you know, but to, it would be very... But if we were a dictator, we would, we would give it more time. How funny yeah. would it be? I'd, I'd call them the homophobes and make oh, them the, wear the know, LGBT you know, flag. Wait a second. I, I don't want to fuck this up, okay? But I think it was Germany. And one of their kings, I think it was, it might have been Leopold. I'm not sure anymore. But he actually had a battalion of very tall men. Like he literally recruited very tall men and he would pay premium prices for people to bring them tall men. I think I've heard this is a long time ago. No? Yeah, it's like the, it's like uh, Imperial think, Germany, right? So it was it German or French. I feel like that was a I French. think it was Germany. It could be. Yeah, somewhere. But it was yeah, 1700. Prussian, like the yeah. Prussian uh, uh, king. And he would like, like people would literally kidnap tall people and, say, and bring them to him. And then he, they would like... A lot of times they forgot to do air holes. Yeah. <laughs> no, seriously. I, I remember learning this in school. A lot of times during shipment yeah. over like across the sea or something. Yeah. You can't just put people in crates like that. Yeah. yeah bro. Yeah. Like you have to... You need air holes. You need at least, food. Yeah, a little bit. Uh, but, a lot of these tall anyhow, people arrived there. And then he tried even to like br breed them. To have like more tall people, tall soldiers, which is like when I think about I feel it, like I'm that like, that takes so long. Like, like if you're fighting with like melee weapons, like swords and like you know clubs and stuff, I get it. Big, strong, good, right? But if you're being shot at, it's probably not big, bad. probably not good. Did uh? yeah, and it was like in a time where they had like muskets, so it was like a between thing. So maybe yeah, okay, maybe big. But see, then once again, the tall something. people thing just seems like bad organizing. Because like, oh, you're a king, you have all the resources, yeah. you want to build a special uh, force yeah. for your thing. So you just think, ah, oh, tall people are cool. Instead, it's like, all right, here's five people, travel around the world, mm. find the best fighters anywhere, mm. come back with the info, bring yeah. maybe one or two, pay yeah, them a good yeah, fee, yeah. let's yeah. see how they fight with what they fight yeah. with. It's like, all right, I like these Muay Thai guys. Yeah. I like uh, these Japanese katana yeah. uh, people. I like the fill with the stick fight. Yeah. I like the African guys yeah. from there and just assemble different ones. Your own Avengers. Basically, yeah. but still have a battalion, yeah. but not kidnap people. Just say like, hey, we... just because they're tall. Because that's yeah, not the, like exactly. that's not... And also that doesn't mean you're a good fighter. Exactly. Like, yeah. Sebastian Hochwanner would have been kidnapped. <laughs> and it would have been the most disappointing <laughs> fighter <laughs> ever to live. On the planet Earth. And I love you, Sebastian. Please don't take this the wrong way. But as far as a soldier goes, no. <laughs> he drinks like one. Though. He drinks like one, but yeah. that's uh, like as soldier capabilities. It's yeah, probably yeah. not. He, the he's best. not good at soldiering. Yeah. Exactly. So if you want to have a tall battalion that carries stuff and shoots and stuff, yeah. and they bring, have the tall guys. Yeah. The tall guys go in, fr and in front of the tall guys, you bring the short term Muay Thai guys. Yeah. Who like explore and go and yeah, they're like yeah. you know close like the combat. special forces and then the special forces i'm not even like... sure if this battalion was not just for show which is even funnier it, which is even more stupid was right? that frederick the great might have been because he was not that great so he got great man he was yeah, okay. oh, he... <laughs> he was oh. kind of into uh men I can. Oh. <laughs> it's not hard to imagine he is had that a maybe the reason taller oh. <laughs> He had to personally test them all to see, ah, to how, see how good their stamina is for battle. Yeah, yeah, with the you know with yeah, the yeah, with exactly. the banner. It was yeah, very yeah. important to know. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, that might that makes. And sense. if that was the case, imagine we got way it, off topic, bro. Imagine <laughs> how pissed he was when they arrived dead in the crate. <laughs> oh, <laughs> <God. laughs> like, oh my god! I'm gonna have a 15 tall people fuck fest. Guys, God damn it. guys, Another we one. spoke about this. <laughs> Look how handsome they were. <laughs> this was such a waste. Oh, and God. also to talk about trying to breed them to make more, that just feels inefficient, right? Yeah. I'm the king now and I want to breed out this tall people army. Yeah. So back then, like, how fast can I get 500 men and 500 tall women back here? It must take a year and a half. Two. Let's say, yeah. So then we pair them up. 
Yeah. Now you start breeding. Yeah. So let's say give them like nine months, ten months. Yeah, let's say it all children. immediately goes well. So it's nine, another yeah. year. Yeah. So now you're two and a half years in and basically you have 250 infants. That might, might. actually not be that tall. Like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but you can do it over and over and over again and grow like, you know. Sure, but it's still... And then you like, can like have the infant. That's what, 18 are, years until fighting we, age? We are 16, 18? We are thinking about this in way too detail. <laughs> and I then don't you know, don't I know how intrigued. many of them are going to be men. That's the other thing. Yeah. So you have, at best, you have less than 250. Yeah, so... so yeah, so let's say if even 50, it's a 50, 50, 50, you have like 100. 175. No, uh, seven, no, what's... Yeah, like 125, 125, 125 every year, let's say, if they like get kids every yeah. year. Let's but then say, again, you know, this is the 1700s, so a bunch of women died during childbirth. Just also after, that. So you have to keep... And it. a bunch of children died during childbirth, too. I know. See, that's what I said. It's I very inefficient. I you're don't think he thought right. this true. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah. if everything goes really well, in 30 years, yeah. I'll have a really tall army. Yeah, of like... Maybe thousand people. If yeah, I'm lucky. at best. Yeah, because you know a lot of other things happen, like <laughs> disease, plagues. Yeah, exactly. Some you know birth accidents, <laughs> birth defects, birth defects. Fuck, this this is the, not an efficient. We, are, we, we got way off topic. <laughs> but isn't it intriguing? Like, if you had to, how would you? And every way we look at it is just, well, this is just a pain in the ass. Yeah, if you <laughs> look at it. It's a really stupid long project. <laughs> it's a stupid long project. It's probably done. <laughs> like during the same amount of time, 30 years you're doing this, you probably have the same amount of tall people in country by accident. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. You could just say, hey, tall people, if you come to me, I will pay you, I don't know, you know, a good amount of money as a signing bonus. And then all of you don't even have to make them millionaires. You just have to say like, "Hey, uh, imagine ah, if someone like you will told never you have now, to work again." Like exactly, yeah, you will be a soldier. Like if someone told well. you now, like if yeah. to do this, uh, we will pay you two and a half thousand euros a month every month for yeah. the rest of your life. Yeah, how great is that? You yeah. know, you're never yeah. a millionaire, but yeah. you're like, okay, cool. I can yeah. rent a nice apartment. Yeah. Have a little side hustle. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Have have like you know no stress about bills and stuff. That's that's and amazing. Then only do yeah. what I love yeah, and yeah, yeah, still yeah. have you know. If you yeah. like what you do and still want to keep your job, you can now have two and a half thousand euros just for rent. Yeah. Forever. Yeah, forever. That's and great. have like a really <laughs> expensive apartment. Yeah. But yeah. if that's your thing. Yeah. Yeah. Like in the first district, yeah. overlooking. Well, imagine if you have a bunch of savings. You love what you do. You yeah. already make good money. Yeah. And now you have two and a half K for doing something like living closer to wherever, yeah, you yeah. know, occasionally having to impregnate but another I, tall okay, woman. I have to, <laughs> we have to stop, you know, because we got way off topic. So back to the coup attempt. <laughs> yeah, the coup attempt in Russia. Do By the tall soldiers. <laughs> <laughs> Toy soldiers? Toy soldiers. Eminem started playing <laughs> yeah. in my head. <laughs> uh... Yeah, the tall so, uh, so the coup attempt in Russia. So the thing is, I I, I, I uh, watched this documentary about Chinese private security companies being a really big thing in Africa. Chinese security companies. Yes, and the reason is that you know China has a bunch of like mines and pipelines and stuff like that, and they want to secure them in Africa. But since China is absolutely anti-imperialistic they don't want to send their own troops to africa so what they do is hey soldier you're fired now from the army you're hired in the private security company you're going to africa tomorrow and you're getting paid well so basically it's like chinese blackwater so they're they're sending these people but they're not soldiers so it's not an army like a Person, military a presence yeah. but they are like kind of indirectly being they kind of have a gun and a uniform no they have a uniform and a gun for sure but it's not military they have tanks Chilla. like they, they have tanks they have cannons they have like everything for sure yeah 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 we're not <laughs> yeah, but but that's <clears throat> and basically wagner group is the same thing because i, I uh, uh, saw this article that the big, uh, a really giant uh, contingent of Wagner, Wagner troops are in Africa, oh. securing 
Russian, uh, you know, minds and business interests there. And now they are like basically kind of cut loose and they don't know what to do because, you know, the whole situation in Russia. So the Russians and the Chinese are now facing off in Africa. No, they're not facing <laughs> off. They're actually working together. Ah, so yeah. Ah, bricks. Yeah, yeah that's yeah. nice. So that's why they are like, you know, but th this is like, uh, okay, what are we going to do now? Like, uh, because they are basically their, like basically their army without a command. But they are not under the command of the army really? or any other government thing. So it's like basically there's a giant mercenary army in Africa, Russian mercenary army in Africa right now with no commander. And everyone's like, what the fuck is this? And they're like, we don't know. We were just, we're just following orders. Yeah, don't we say that. <laughs> <laughs> don't say that. <laughs> not good. <laughs> not good. Um, please don't. Yeah. So this was a shit show. So what about the 6.2 billion you think like the CIA called Mr. P? And I'm was like, sure. I'm sure. It's because you know why I'm sure? Hmm? Because they said that's not what happened. <laughs> so I'm sure that's what happened. <laughs> and and the CIA now is in their office like, can he do that? Can, can he do that? Can he do that? Because, <laughs> like, you know, the CIA is like, we're going to pay this guy off. Yeah. It's going to be awesome, create inner shit. Yeah. And the guy just went, yo, Putin, you fine if we split the money? In this? Yeah. yeah, Putin's like, yeah, 40, Yeah, of course. Like, yeah, love you, Vlado. Yeah. yeah. yeah hung up. He's like, all right, let's fuck around a bit and then yeah. go back. And the CIA is like, can he? What? No, that's not. Hey, hey. That's not how deals work. You know, it's kind of like when your drug dealer screws you over, you can't go to the police. And like the CIA was sitting there like, who do, who do we call? Who do we like, call? <laughs> What do we do? Can, can he? He's not allowed. Hey! Imagine they call FSB. <laughs> it's like, yo! <laughs> FSB! <laughs> yeah. The Russian Secret Service. Like, hey, one of your guys stole like 6.3 billion. No, I'm sure if they did, the, no, they called him again after yeah. he did, after he went back to his position. Yeah. It was like, what was that? And all he heard was Russians laughing and <laughs> clinking glasses in the background. Like, ha, 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 he thought. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> We My will... son has now new Rolex. <laughs> new Rolex? He has the new Rolex factory. Yeah, new Rolex <laughs> Dude, $3 billion. $3 billion. Like Elon Musk... That's so much, I wouldn't even want that much. Like, I want to cap out at a few hundred million best. Uh, a few, just a few? <laughs> at, at, at the absolute height, yeah, but because billions is like already a number where you're never Let free me ask of you work. this in a different way because you talked about it before. Imagine you never had to work again. Yeah. Okay? You never have to work again. You never have to worry about like, you know, bills and rent and shit like that. What would you do? Comedy. I do comedy. The same thing I'm doing now. Yeah. So you're doing what's your passion, basically. Yeah. 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 I mean, I would stop my bar job. Of course. Yeah. But, but like, that, you, because all. you don't need anything else. To, exactly. Yeah. Like now it's like a little help. Like I, I don't need it now either, but it's like, oh, this is so much better to do that now because otherwise I would have had to count coins until mm. it's season again to get back on it's the road. because you're Jewish. With counting coins. Well, we always <laughs> count coins, but now we have to count more coins. So, you know, <laughs> Yes. Or less coins. Hey, what, what, one more and I'm shutting off your account, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> one phone call. We run it, remember? <laughs> ask, Very dangerous. Ask Kanye. <laughs> ask Kanye how that shit went. Yeah. I think Sia had a joke like that once where he's like, you know, he's like big bearded. Yeah, yeah. I know it was like when, when uh, people tell him, like, oh, you look like a terrorist. And he's yeah. like, first of all, that's a really shitty thing to just say to a Muslim guy's face. Yeah. Second of all, if you think I'm a terrorist, maybe you want to mince your fucking words. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you, you're awfully confident for, uh, in front of a potential terrorist. <laughs> True. <laughs> Which is good. <laughs> you know, like, absolutely said. Maybe you want to tone it down a bit. <laughs> yeah, that, that's... Uh, uh, yeah, fuck. Yeah, so comedy. Yeah. I do comedy and if you know if we do that situation what I yeah, said like yeah. let's say two and a half thousand a month yeah out of nothing yeah, yeah. like just always there till the rest of my life yeah. that money is there I probably would get a nice apartment like my rent would probably be like a thousand five mm. some shit like mm. that I'd get it I'd mm. get a good place because mm. now I never have to worry about it it's like basically having it bought the only thing that changes in my life is now my monthly income is a thousand euros 
Yeah, which is like not... That's uh, fantastic. Because yeah. I still do stuff, you know? So that's why, like, imagine if you were a billionaire, right? And you spent a million a month. Right. So I can't really get rid of it. It's thousand months, a billion. Yeah. It's... Mm, nah. Like... You couldn't... Of course you have to do something stupid, like, you know... Develop a cocaine addiction. Uh, or like... Or uh, like... Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's something like you like, have to do something stupid. Yeah, but even if you do that with a billion, I think you kill yourself before you ever kick the For end sure, of the money. You, I think like, you will not reach uh, you will not reach a million. Yeah, you, you're sure you're, you're just surely dead. Blast through it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I have something stupid like imagine buying a lot of it and then getting caught by the cops. <laughs> So now you have a billion to fuck away any way you want. It's yeah. like, well, after twenty years in prison, maybe because yeah, you're maybe. an idiot. Yeah, yeah. You could have just said, "Hey, can you get me a driver with a Bentley?" Nobody stops a Bentley. Yeah. So I just drive me home in that. Yeah. But now you get. But caught. also, also like, uh, like do stupid shit like fly into space or go like ocean diving, <laughs> like. Like, if like, I had a billion to go yeah. ocean diving, I maybe wouldn't try to save money on shit. I go like, guys, did you do oh, the? Do we know that they wanted they, they did that or they just? Well, they just kind of everything. Why did you have a little control of everything? Didn't you? Didn't don't you think there was anyone there? Was like, guys, I think it would be really smart to maybe drop another ten mil and have a proper control board. Also, how thick is this titanium? Th this thick? Well, did you calculate that this works? Yeah, double it. Just to be sure. J j <laughs> do it like the yeah. engineers do. Like, like, uh, hey, yeah. triple it. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Money is not an issue. What do we need? 10 mil? Okay, everybody, two and a half. Come on. Yeah. We're billionaires. We're yeah. four. Yeah. Everybody chip in two and a half mil. You yeah. lose that on poker on a Friday night. <sighs> yeah. Yeah, it's like a, a certain... like. Millions I can follow, a hundred millions is like already the, the point it's, where it's like, for me, it's no, like... but you can't buy anything more. Now, well, once you have well you one, can, you can like have like the biggest yacht in the world and be well, like... You have to make, yeah, okay. Yeah, again, but sure. also maintain it, but yeah, it's like... And also, all my life is built around mainland. Like, I can't just fuck off and live on a yacht forever, <laughs> you know? Like, imagine, imagine you had, like, a, the most expensive yacht in the world, but you live in Austria. <laughs> See, like, that's the thing. Like, what? Why do I... It is just in Wörthersee. Like, yeah. <laughs> How do you even bring it to Wörthersee? It's, it's like, you, you will figure it out. You have money. Oh, but yeah, but right. airship it. Yeah, like... You know, air, airdrop yeah, a yacht yeah. into Wörthersee. And then, like, just block off half of Wörthersee. No, you know what I'd do? I'd take that one billion dollar yacht that we saw in the Mr. Beast video yeah, yeah, yeah. and I'd airdrop that into the Donau in the swimming area. So not the thick one where the ships actually yeah. go. The little one where people swim. And just live there. Yeah. What you gonna do? Remove it? <laughs> F find me every day. <laughs> like that, like that uh, container ship that got stuck in the Swiss Canal. <laughs> Yeah, I'll just park it. <laughs> Guys. Yeah. Just we let it be. We will talk in four months. <laughs> yeah. let it, we'll see. Let it oh, be. God. Just leave it yeah. here for the summer. I hope we, we got a little bit more happier issues by the... I think we did an hour, no? We yeah, did about an hour-ish. Yeah. Yeah. But, uh, yeah. Um, don't... Uh, th there, there's a saying I, I heard a uh, long time before and I basically... It was from a self-defense defen uh, <laughs> Don't fuck around because you'll find out. No, it, basically, it was like, don't do stupid shit with stupid people and go stupid places. That's wisdom. Yeah. Yeah. And stupid shit I think, is the stupid shit. Yeah, it's like... Uh, or don't go stupid places with stupid people and do stupid shit. That's how he, how he said it. And I was like, yeah, yeah, I think for the poor divers who died for the mr p and for the pentagon <laughs> <laughs> and for the russian uh, militia like uh, um, army people who are like stuck in africa now for all of them the same thing counts don't go stupid places with stupid people and do stupid shit although i am looking forward to a hundred years from now having the russian and chinese colonies in africa much like the germans in argentina yeah. Because, you know, imagine politics... Oh, I mean, because they're stuck? Politics change and yeah. everybody kind of just forgets. Yeah. <laughs> like, in the depths of black Africa, 
there's, there's a, a whole Empire. bunch of white people and Chinese people on the other. Well, you mean South Africa? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Basically. Well, South Africa has Indians mostly, <clears throat> not Chinese people. No, but it has Indians and it has white people, right? The boards. Yeah. yeah. No, but it has so much more Indians than white people. That's a joke. It actually, by statistics, I think it has more white people than Indians. But it's like I think Russell Peters has a bit of it. Like I got off the plane in South Africa, and all I saw was Indians. I first saw it's like. To be honest, not that I think of, but there is a lot of Indians in South Africa. Yeah, but you know who was from South Africa? Gandhi. Really? Yeah, Gandhi was born and raised in South Africa. I didn't know that. Exactly. Like really? it, it's like just say last time we were talking about like populations in South Africa, yeah. we googled it yeah. with you know the guys as well, like with four South African friends of mine, and we thought, yeah. like, okay, how many black? Okay, that's my black. Why the Indians said a number, and all five five was in the room, and they didn't count them all. That can't be. That's yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that, 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 that doesn't match. Yeah. yeah, but maybe like Indians are more in the you know in the cities, so they are more visible, because if you have like a bunch of uh, African people and then a bunch of white people like the Indians I are like more visible. Yes, I don't know. I don't want to yeah. say something that looks really bad in 20 years, which is the previous one hour on this <laughs> podcast, basically. <laughs> so at this point, fuck it, cancel me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The only thing I have to say, the Mr. P guy, yeah, you know, uh, this guy who Kremlin killed with like uh, some with something with some poison and he like lost all his hair and like he looks like him he looks already like that yeah. <laughs> like, he looks like you already they have like poisoned him because they tried it it just didn't work he, yeah he like just like no <laughs> it doesn't work with the creme de la kremlin no yeah. <laughs> creme de la kremlin no i think like the poison is in his body he just refuses to you know let it work yeah, it's like a Chuck Norris joke. Yeah. They gave him radioactive shit, and yeah. after four days, the radioactive shit is now Mr. P ish. Yeah, yeah. He didn't get radioactive. The radioactive, the radioactive shit got, got like Mr. him. P, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, <clears throat> I think that was a good solid hour. Of I think we have a lot shit. of clips from this. We do. Uh, nice. We have no idea about anything. Uh, That's why this was funny. Yeah, and uh, I think. Uh, we're dumb. It, yeah. Plugs, follow me on Instagram and on YouTube, and uh, you'll find me. At, yeah, see, look, it, it's it's here. <laughs> follow Tamash and follow me on Humorama. Thank you very much. Thank you.